Welcome and welcome back to Scorpio Tiger's Tarot. I'm Scorpio Tiger. I'm here to do the Yumi We spread for the sign of Libra. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday. I hope you guys are having a wonderful season. It's almost about to come to an end because it's time for us the Scorpios to step in, right? <laughs> but I hope you guys are having a wonderful birthday season. Let's get into this. Okay, this is a, a general reading, so take what resonates, leave the rest. This is a love spread, so reverse roles as needed, okay? Let's get some energies for the Libra Collective. How are they feeling towards love or towards their love interest at this time? The Libra Collective, those that have subscribed to the channel, those who like our videos and share our videos, those that have subscribed, and those that are divinely guided to this reading, what, how are they feeling towards love or towards their love interest? Thank you. Okay, we got the chariot. Let's get let's get some more. How is the okay? Thank you. Okay. So you feel like you're moving forward with your love interest and, and they bring you so much happiness, or you feel like going towards your love interest, okay? Good stuff. Yeah. Looks good to me. How is the energy just coming towards Libra? How are they feeling towards Libra? Five of Cups. Let's get, let's get some more, please. What are they regretting? They're not happy? And we got the Knight of Pentacles. They're not happy. And um, they want to come and make you an offer, but... Or are they waiting for you to get make them an offer? Give us one more, please. What's going on with this energy coming towards Libra? <clears throat> oh, my goodness. They feel alone right now. And either they want to make an offer to you, or they're waiting on you to come and make an offer to them, Libra. I'm not really sure. Here. You guys, somebody's admiring someone. Or, um, you guys had a, a, a lovely relationship, a partnership, but it's, I don't know. Let's get some mutual energies. They're, they're regretting not making you an offer or they regret that you're not coming forward, but you're thinking about going more making a move towards this person. Let's get some let's get some mutual energies. Let's get the mutual energies between Libra and this energy. Thank you. All right, there's gonna be some clarity here with the ace of swords. Thank you. Thank you, Spirit. And the five of five of swords. Okay. Some clarity on why somebody walked away. Is that what that is? Mutual energies between these two. We got the Six of Pentacles. We got the Eight of Wands. I mean, the Nine of Wands. The Wheel of Fortune. Mutual energies. Thank you. And the seven of cups. Somebody has made up their mind. Libra, it looks like to me, at the bottom of the deck, we got the nine of uh, pentacles. Okay, money good, looking good, all that. All right. And what it looks like to me, Libra, is that uh, you guys have walked away from this person um, because you weren't getting what you wanted, but for some reason, you're now strategizing a plan to go get them. You've made up your mind that they are the one for you. I, I'm so confused. Let's, let's clarify. The Ace of Swords, why is this here for the Libra Collective? Why is the Ace of Swords here? I mean, not for the Libra Collective, for the Mutual Energies. Why is the Ace of Swords here for these two energies here? 
Why is the Ace of Swords here for these two energies? Thank you, Spirit. Like y'all broke up and, and you gained some clarity. You got the Queen of Cups in reverse in the world. Okay. Somebody's been sitting in like a, a, a some sort of pity party, looks like to me. But they've gained some clarity. Okay. They've gained some clarity about the whole situation. Or that may be why you cut to a person off, Libra, because they were too clingy and needy. So you decided to cut them off and put an end to that karmic cycle and walk away. Even though you love them. Wow. Libras. Okay, but they, they was just too clingy. The five of swords. Why is this here? Why is the five of swords here? For the Libra in their person. Okay. Yeah, it, it looks like you walked away. We got the Ace of Cups. Love overflowing, money good and everything. But you you love them. Everything was fine. They was just too clingy and you walked away. And now you're being haunted by the memories of how happy this person made you. Come on now. Six of six of pentacles. Why is this easy? Why is the six of pentacles here for Libra in their person? <laughs> Why is the six of pentacles here? Thank you. Okay. Okay, we got the hangman in reverse. It's saying that you need to, you, you want this relationship or something. You want this partnership with this person. But you need to, you need to go into prayer about it first. That's what it looks like. Give us one more for that Six of Pentacles, please. Thank you. We got the star in reverse and the page of cups in reverse. Give me just a second. The star in reverse. I went the wrong way. Star is what, 17? <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, because although you want this equal give or take with this person, you're not feeling too good about the whole situation. It says professional help uh, may be needed. You need to go into prayer. Mm -hmm. Somebody needs to get out of a victim mentality. What is that page of cups? In reverse, actions have consequences. The deception. That's what it looks like. Like somebody needs to go in and in a prayer because they're feeling hopeless and stuff. And I'm guessing it's that person. It's your person. That's not you, Libra. That's your person. They're feeling hopeless at this time. And they may need some professional help because you don't you don't walk away from this person, even though you loved them. Yeah, that's what they're saying. Maybe you guys need to communicate with the Queen of Swords and the Six of Cups. Maybe you need to communicate clearly to this person as to what it is that they need to be doing. Okay? Yeah. Why is the Nine of Wands here? I keep hearing they try. They try. Um, um, they, they, either you try to talk to them and this person really got mental issues, something going on with them. Or, um, yeah, y'all, like y'all tried to have a relationship with this person and tried to have a mutual, uh, a mutual relationship given and given as much as you were taking, but this person has issues. They, they, they really may need therapy. Yeah. Why is the nine of wands here? Thank you, spirit.
Last the nine of wands here. So this has caused you to be guarded. Yeah, it caused you to be guarded with this person because you want your emotional satisfaction. And they need to heal. That's what I'm getting from that. Yeah, they need to heal. A little fortune. Yeah. In time, you're going to get your, your wish fulfilled. You're going to get what it is you want. Ooh, wait. Why is the Seven of Cups here in reverse? Why is the Seven of Cups here in reverse? Believe we're a new person. We got the Page of Wands. Give us one more, please. Thank you. And the um, Seven of Wands. I mean, the Six of Wands. Let me see something real quick. <clears throat> I just want to double check that Seven of Cups. In reverse. Okay, yeah. yeah. You've gotten clear about what you need from love. So that's probably what it's telling you. You ain't got clear about what you need from love by getting away from this person. Oh my. Yeah, you done got clear. You focused. And you're going to be admired for, for, for moving past the situation. This person, I'm sorry, Cross Watcher, but, but this is saying that the Cross Watcher has some mental issues of dependency and neediness and that, that, that wrecked Libra's nerves. But Libra's moving uh, moving on. That's why you got, that's Libra, that's why you got the Cancer energy of the chariot and the Leo energy of the moon. You decided to move on to your happiness. That's how you're feeling about this person. And this person is hurt because they think that, they thought that you were the one. This is a stable relationship, stable energy. And they think that they thought that you were the one. They are devastated that this did not work out. And they are feeling really alone right now. Not telling you that so you run back and be like, oh, no, I'm not telling you that. I'm telling you that because um, just so that you know that this person is going through it. And, um, yeah, they need to, they need to, to go get some, uh, they need to talk to the most high. They, they need to go into prayer. And, 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 and it, it does not hurt to get some, um. It does not hurt to get some counsel. I can't make this stuff up. Counsel. It does not hurt to get counsel. It, it doesn't hurt. Any advice? I, I don't even think you need any advice, uh, Libra, because you like you know made your, your mind up here. You you had to get out because the person was just too needy. Anything for the um, Libra collecting? Any advice as far as love for the Libra collecting? Hmm. I thought I saw some clip up. What was that? Oh, that was too weird. Okay. Last time, Spirit, thank you. <clears throat> anything from the little collective. I don't think that you're gonna get anything from this deck because you 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 you're moving on. And that's what's gonna bring you your happiness. You're gonna have your happiness and contentment later. Yeah. That is you guys reading. I don't think I have anything else that would even, any other deck that even help you with this reading here. But thank you so much, Libra. You guys, good luck with this. And um, I will talk to you guys soon. Happy birthday, Libra. Take care.